Hello friends, today I am going to teach you one of the very basic topics in mathematics which is number system. So start with its definition first. A number system is defined as a system of writing for expressing numbers. So basically it's a system where we express numbers. And the most commonly and widely used system of numbers which we use in our daily life is Hindu Arabian number system. And what exactly this Hindu Arabian number system is? It is a combination of 10 digits, namely 1, 2, 9 and 0. And the combination of these 10 numbers, we can make infinite numbers. Moving on to our next topic, which is representation of numbers. So actually, we are familiar about the numbers which we use in our daily life. But again, how we represent those numbers? So representation of the numbers can be done in two ways. The first one is Indian number system. And the second one is international number system. So in Indian number system, uh, how we actually represent a number as you can see here is a place value chart which is made according to Indian number system and the representation of number is done into groups basically the number is divided into groups and those groups are called periods namely as ones thousands lakhs and crores and we always start the grouping of any number which is given to you is always from the right corner so first we group into three digits as you can see there's a period named once and in once there are three places once tens and hundred and after that there's a period thousand in that you have two places thousand ten thousand and again the period lakhs in which we have again two period two places lakhs and 10 lakhs and again crores in which we have crore and 10 crores so as you can see what is the actual scenario of grouping uh, the number according to the periods so we see that if we start from the right corner we start a number first group a number from the right corner first three digits and then again two digit and two digit and so on so this is how we actually represent a number in an Indian system of numeration and you must be very aware about it a number according to Indian number system so our topic is how we can write a number in Indian number system as we know that we generally represent a number according to their period so again this is the actual scenario which is used here also it says number in Indian number system are written based on the different periods which are crores, lakhs, thousand and once and again we again start separating our periods always from the right corner and how we separate actually the periods by commas and you can see here I have taken one example and the number says 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So how we actually write the number according to their periods. So you can make a place chart, place value chart actually 1,000 lakhs crore are basically the places. The places at which each and every digit of the number are placed. So we always start from the right corner. So as we start from the right, the number coming at the right is 9. So we first place in the period, the first period is 1's and in the 1's we have 3 places and in the rightmost we have 1. So at 1 we place 9, then come 10, at 10 we place 8, at 100 we place 7 and then moving on to our next period which is 1000. In 1000 we have 2 place values. First at the right is 1000, at this place comes 6 and then 10,000 at this place comes 5 and the next period is lakhs. In that we have two place values lakhs, at lakhs comes 4, at 10 lakhs comes 3 and in crore we have two place value 
crores and 10 crore at crore comes 2 and at 10 crore comes 1 so this is how we actually write numbers and if you're actually so if you can see i have already mentioned the number um, by placing commas according to their periods the number is separated by comma as you can see uh, 12 comma 34 comma 56 comma 789 so you can understand i have started from the rightmost corner and first group three digits then place one comma and then two digit then place a comma then again two digit and place comma so this is how we can write number in indian number system so our next and the last topic of today's lecture is reading of number according to indian number system so again the same scenario we'll read our number system according to our periods because periods are the only ways we can actually um, group the number and we can actually show the different periods as it says periods like one thousands lakhs crore they are used to read the numbers easily that's why we use them so let's again take an example which says 1 2 comma 3 4 comma 1 2 comma 3 5 4 so again what you do is basically make a place value chart and place all the digits according to their periods in the period which they actually comes okay and how we actually read is what you have to do is always start reading from the leftmost corner period okay so at the leftmost corner period comes crore so basically at leftmost period uh, crores comes 12 as a value so basically how we read 12 as 12 and after 12 you have just to mention the period crores and then again we'll moving to the right from the left to the right comes 34 and what is the period lakhs then comes thousand in thousand we have the number 12 and then what is the period thousand and the rightmost comes once and what is the actual value there three five four so what we read it as three hundred fifty four we do not need to mention the period once we never mentions it we only mention okay. still thousand so how we read the number the number is read as 12 crores 34 lakhs 12,304 okay guys this is for today's lecture I hope you very well understand the topic number system and if you find this content really helpful please do share like and do not forget to subscribe my channel as this is my very first video so please please be support Thank you and I will send such more videos like this in the future. Thank you.